Thanks for watching Crokinus Center. We have another singles preliminary round match from the 2022 NCAA Players Championship. And this one is between Booth Van and shooting the red discs and Chris Flossback shooting the black discs. And shot close to the 20 hole, so it looks like Flossback is leaning across, possibly to go for the touch 20. Boy, it makes it 20 and almost makes it take it. It looks like the disc just stays on there, so open 20 chance now for Van. It's misses just to the right of the hole. This gives Floss back a chance to uh, play to the outside for a little bit. <laughs> Van, <laughs> stressing that he uh, was trying to go for the peel on those last couple shots. Certainly that's what he wants to do. Flossback gets that takeout to go. Van tries to rattle that one around in between the pegs, hoping for a 20, but it doesn't fall there. Oh, great shot from Flossback. Makes the takeout 20 there, and that will clinch this opening round. Didn't even really need that, that takeout 20, but made it all the same and made it look pretty nice. And Flossback gets the first two points of this preliminary round game. All players play 12 games in the preliminary round, and the top 24 scorers advance to the next round of this NCAA Players Championship. Flossback opens round two with a 20. Van responds. When Flossback Misses all the way through the house there, loses the shooter. Then takes advantage, scores another 20. Up a 20 with the hammer. And just misses over top, see if Flossback goes for the fall through 20 here. Just misses a little bit wide of the hole. And looks like he tried to pull that to his own disc back a little bit, but it's stuck in between the pegs. Chance for a rebound here for Flossback. Doesn't get it though, it just started a hit and stick. He yeah, might have another opportunity here. Yeah, good action on that one. Pulls the, big, the disc back to his side of the board. Uh, hit and stick there from Van leaves just a really, really tough follow through attempt here. It's a little bit of a push, but not enough to the hole, so a hit and stick here for Van to get the two points. And he gets it to go, so Booth Van responds with two points on his own hammer there to tie up this game at two points each. And opens round three with a 20. Flossback's uh, open 20 again. This is, uh, this time just long, ends up losing the shooter. So you've been a bit of a hole here to start out this third round. Ooh, Van shot. I don't think he was quite going for that rebound 20, but he almost made it. Good spot, that's close to a peg. Tough takeout here. Flossback makes it, trying to inch things a little bit closer to that 20 hole so he can level up the count in this game. Van, bit of a mistake there, misses on the takeout, loses the shooter. Flossback takes advantage, tying up the 20 count with only three shots left for each player here. Van with a good response, answering back against his mistake. Oh, and Flossback again, just struggling a little bit with, I think really more so with the line, not necessarily the weight on those open 20s. And Van piles in another 20. Flossback responds. Van's up a 20 here. Flossback needs a fall through 20 to try to tie up this round. I can't get it to go, so 
Van will win those two points against the hammer there with uh, some strong open 20 shooting. So the final round of this preliminary matchup. Uh, start off with Chris Flossback opening. I'm sure they'll be looking for an open 20 here to start off. Gets it to go. When Van's shot just bounces out. Early advantage to Flossback. And a nice roll there in between the pegs. Tough takeout here for Van. Makes it and sticks it in a nice spot too. So now a tough takeout to Flossback. Can't get the takeout, but ends up leaving us just in a pretty good spot. And Van does not get the takeout either, so we're getting a little bit complicated here. Van electing to stay back, maybe try to hide a little bit, but uh, you have to get a couple more points on the board with Flossback having a 20 advantage. There's 25 on the board for Red here. Flossback he could get a double. It would be great. I don't think the disc really line up for that right now. I, mean, I think he might have left an out, an op, uh, a 20 opportunity here for Van on that missed takeout. Oh, wow. Van going for the 20. Gets a, gets a rebound. Doesn't end up hitting the black disc at all. And Flossback adds another 15 on the board here. Booth Van... We need a double to win this round. And no, just uh, just ends up putting on another 15 on the board with Flossback. We'll end up taking what was sort of a chaotic fourth round there. Gets the two points, and these two end off this preliminary round game with a 4-4 tie.